YouTube. My name is Marcus Sharp, of course, and this is Workout Myth Wednesday, where I hope to debunk some of the most popular theories in fitness. And today, we'll be talking about one of the most popular, probably the most debated topic in fitness, which is, what's going to help you burn fat more? Weight training or cardio? And the answer is... They both have different effects. <laughs> So it really just depends on what you're looking for. Are you looking more for health or are you looking more towards just losing fat? If you're looking for just losing fat, without a question, go with resistance training. Go with your weight training, do your heavy lifts, do uh, supersets, do like everything that has to do with weights. That will help you lose the most weight and burn as much fat. Now, if you're looking more from a health perspective, as far as like cardiovascular health, then yes, that is where the clear-cut winner, well, not really clear-cut, but just a lot better for you winner, would be in your cardio, so that you're running, you're walking, you're jogging, uh, jump roping, all those types of exercises, swimming, that's where you'll, that's where uh, cardio wins. But cardio is not the only way to have a healthy cardiovascular system, and that's why I me mean, personally, I recommend that if people want to lose weight while also staying healthy, that they should be doing a majority of their workout should be uh, composed of resistance training. Now I'm not saying don't run, I'm not saying don't do your cardio, but it shouldn't take over your whole workout and here's why. So the two main reasons why I prefer and I recommend for people to lose weight is to go with your resistance training is because for one reason it takes a lot less energy to burn those calories as it would be compared to cardio. For example, I'm going to give you guys two scenarios with both being a male that's 160 pounds. So the first male, he's doing cardio and he's going to do two miles at an eight minute pace. So that's 16 minutes of running total. And he's only going to burn 242 calories. And that's six, that's running two miles at an eight minute pace. How many of you guys can actually run one mile at an eight minute pace? That's not like putting you down, but that's like just being realistic. So to put two miles back to back and you're only going to burn 242 calories, that's like a medium, that's like a medium soda. So keep that in mind. And I'll compare that to another male who's 160 pounds, but he does 15 minutes of squats. He's going to burn 230 calories. Now, Yes, he burned 12 less calories than the guy running, but after you run two miles, you're you're done. You're just you're so tired. You're gonna be you're gonna want to just go home and end that workout. Whereas if you do 15 minutes of squats, you're still ready to go. You're still ready to hit other. You're still ready to hit like lunges and uh, maybe even do some front squats or some leg extensions or a leg press like you're still you still have enough energy to finish out that workout so whereas if you just run the two miles you're just going to only burn a total of 242 calories whereas if you're doing your resistance training you will burn the 230 calories from the squats alone and then you'll add on more because you'll have enough energy to keep on going with your workout and you'll burn I mean, anywhere upwards of like five or six hundred calories, depending on how intensely you're going well with the workout. And the second reason is that the more muscle that you have on you, the more calories that you burn uh, while you're sedentary or while you're resting. So for every 10 pounds of muscle that you have on your body, you're going to be burning an extra 50 calories. So take that into advice. I mean, as, if you're building muscle while you're doing your resistance training, that just means that for every 10 pounds of muscle that you're adding while you're also shedding fat, you're going to be burning 50 more calories, which is going to help you stay which is going to help you stay um, in shape and not gain back that weight because if you have more muscle on your frame, that means that you're going to be burning more calories even even if you're not going to the gym, then you'll still be burning calories. So say you miss a couple of days, the muscle that you've built on will help burn those extra calories for you. So ladies and gentlemen, those of you who walk straight past all the weight equipment when you're going to the gym and go straight to the treadmills and walk on the treadmills for an hour, please take my advice and cut that, cut the cardio down to maybe like 15 to 20 minutes to help uh, maybe as like a cool down for your workout and 
try some of those uh, weight exercises. Try some resistance training. You'll realize that you'll be burning a lot more calories in the same amount of time. You could be burning anywhere like two to three, maybe even four times as many calories doing weight training in the same amount of time as you would doing cardio. So just take that into advice, you guys. So in conclusion, don't be afraid to try some of those uh, weight machines or to really just try and expand your uh, exercising horizons, I guess you would call it. Um, try and do some bench or do some squats or do some leg press or just try to incorporate weights into your workouts if you're not already doing it because you'll be burning more fat doing it and also getting healthier. But also I'm not saying don't do your cardio because cardio is a very, very important part of exercising. I'm just saying that you, unless, unless you're specifically training for, um, events or sports that you need to have great cardiovascular uh, health and endurance I would say just for overall just fat burning and weight loss to really um, give uh, resistance training a try so I hope that you guys like this video if you did be sure to leave this video a like also if you're an SC fan be sure to share this video and then leave it a like <laughs> also don't forget to comment down below on any other myths that you might want me to break also don't forget to subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the next one Doses. Fight.